Hey everybody, this is Brenniger. I thought it's about time I did a round the world update for you. This is my fry starter tank. I have my Ancestress in this, and I have used super glue gel to put baby Java fern on this driftwood decoration. Um, the Ancestress doesn't use his hide very often. He does fit in there easily because he's still young, but he tends to hide behind the driftwood and hangs out on the sponge filter intake a lot. Um, oh, there he is. Oh, there he went. Um, I have a tiny novelty fork that I've used to skewer a piece of cucumber but he's not interested in it right now because I just did a water change today and he's still a little skittish so hopefully there are fry in this fry starter tank from my 75 this is my quarantine tank in which I recently put four adult female fancy guppies and the night that I purchased them one of them dropped so they already have fry they're doing well I'm feeding them Ryan shrimp new ply and feeding them sinking pellets in a shot glass there's lots of foliage for the fry to hide and I'm looking forward to discovering some males amongst these fry to put in my planted 10 gallon tank. This is my 112. Among these adult Colombian tetra are six which I purchased as new breeding stock and of course I don't know which ones they are. They're definitely the largest because they are the oldest. But hopefully I won't wind up selling them back for store credit when I take 50 to my local pet store. And this is a 75. As I say, need a water change today, so the tank's looking very nice with plants that have been soaking in bleach water and rinsed thoroughly, of course, before adding them to the tank and using prime dechlorinator. These are sub-adults, an inch or just under an inch long. So they're not quite ready to trade to my local fish store. But of course I am looking forward to doing that because, well, I love doing it. And it does supplement the hobby and I have a list of things that I want to get when I make that trip. Because I call it my local fish store, but actually... It's in a neighboring state and about 40 miles away. Last on the round of the round the world update is my planted 10 gallon aquarium. I have Anubius and Java fern. The three neon tetra that survived from the eight that I purchased are doing well. Apparently it was the shock of transfer from the pet store and acclimating to a new tank that killed five out of eight. But I am looking forward to taking Pectex advice and going with live bearers so I should have some fancy male guppies 
to beautify this tank soon. And of course I have sub-adult large fry Colombian Tetra in this tank. Uh, they don't do much to beautify the tank but they sure make the neon Tetra feel more comfortable, safe. The more small fish in the tank the better. And as far as I know there are still two auto sinkless in this tank. Um, I saw them as late as last night. And I believe they're hiding behind the driftwood right now. And that is my around the world update. Thank you for watching. I'll see you real soon on the next one.